Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and hello again Scorpio. Alrighty, today we are doing a love reading and we have a specific subject. So this question is, do they share your love, trust and goals? Important questions. So spread description is in the description box, but I'm going to pull 16 cards, seven on your side and we're going to put seven on your suspect prospect side and then we're going to pull two cards for a possibility and a guiding note so general reading guys coming back again in may but the notes are hopefully uh, practical and timeless now let's say the positions are your relationship appetite your current energy and your uh, reaction manifesting energy to suspect prospect okay and then we are looking at elements of your thought process about the relationship so we will look at attraction trust shared goals and commitment to the concept of the two of you of the relationship we're doing the same exact thing here for your uh, prospect and then we'll put the possibility here and a guiding note all righty scorpio we begin in terms of relationship appetite here for you with a two of cups <sighs> the idea of duality okay this could be something on our mind when will i how should i and what to do and it looks like a thought right um in terms of a core energy there's more of that so we have the lover card here and i can't help but say you may be you may be considering two options here and the two options don't always have to be two people it's two situations right it's two offerings one way or another that lover is going to lean towards what's in their heart we're beginning the reading here saying a two of cups beginning it on a romantic note the thought of someone togetherness and so on and so forth core energy is about when do i get to make that decision when do i get to make that choice okay and then as you connect here you have a five of wands inspired changing um, attitude if you will an inspired thought change as well so so far so positive leaning quite romantically scorpio looking for this oomph for this energy for this spark with that connection on their side we begin with an eight of swords okay relationship appetite is a thought is advancing in a logical format if you will okay thinking about it high level maybe but logically speaking and advancing it forward in terms of current energy it's the temperance card which in a way leans towards complementing this advancing the thought here forward what do i mean by that trying to find the chemistry so uh, temperance is also about you know what finding balance finding ways to compromise finding ways to moderate certain things so uh, there is a little bit of a balancing act here between those two uh, energies and then as they manifest presentation is that of a romantic persona okay with a king of cups yet kings are also wise kings are also full of knowledge so balanced romantic open to finding chemistry as much as you are open to making a choice making a determination that's what i see so far on your side in terms of attraction it's as if you're looking for the wholesome picture your goal is to not have um open ends if you will your goal is to have the attraction be mind body and soul so it's a ten of coins here a ten of completion on their mind they're maybe driven more by the emotional side and having had confidence or maybe seeking the confidence in the connection between you and them on their side it's more sentimental on your side it's more let's have a wholesome view do we like each other really do we like the things we say to each other are our minds aligned um physical aspects of course and other uh shall we say elements of attraction but overall you have a wholesome idea scorpio they have the confidence they're driven to gain confidence with that kind of attraction energy between the both of you and it may be as well that they're looking for it looking for a nod looking for yes i am attracted to you that's a seven that says i'm not 
or I'm working on gaining some um, confidence as well. So there may be the need for this back and forth. In terms of trust, you have a creative energy here. You have the, shall we say, <laughs> the magician or what do we call him really? Uh, the manifester to a person who is um, able to find solutions on traditional ways. This energy is interesting because this energy takes risks, okay? Uh, this energy here is looking for priorities. So on their side, they're like, okay, I build trust when I have a direction. I build trust when my priorities are set. I'm able to open up when that is the case. When there are changing elements, when there are unusual events, it's maybe hard for them to stay in that mode, if you will, Scorpio. So that's something we mind in conversation, okay? Sometimes telling too much of a, you know what, a long process may give someone the wrong impression, especially if they don't have the time to listen, if they don't have the ability to listen and understand about past situations. So communication is very, very important here. We don't want the ambiguity of a magician. We don't want the, I know how it's done, just trust me. What they may be seeking more, Scorpio, is yes, but show me how, okay? I want to have that confidence to know that this is a logical step, if you will. So, could go both ways, but really, um, I hope this resonates. Now, in terms of shared goals, you have big ideas, big inspiration there with a Knight of Wands. They have also big ideas, six, shall we say, six-sided um, Ace of Cups, a huge, huge element of passion they have as well. So, looking, look at this, Scorpio. There's quite a bit of cups here. There's quite a bit of water. There's quite a bit of fluidity here. And there is a need for structure to establish trust. There's a lot of energy on your side, Scorpio. Okay, so you could be leading this effort. You could be leading the charge in that relationship, in those discussions. But just be aware that uh, they're going to need more time to, you know what, pick and meet you at the step where you are. If those align and resonate, providing this attraction is there too. They may need a little bit more, you know, a direct communication from you. Now, in terms of commitment, well, the subject to them um, is about a change, okay? So it's not necessarily they're not used to commitment and that's a sudden change. No, the commitment idea here, you're driven by emotion again with the Eight of Cups. To them, they're considering the changes they have to make in order to be as committed, in order to uh, meet you eye to eye on that and being honest as well so i don't find i don't want to say a reluctant here i just find a process where someone wants to have a few steps to be assured okay let's look at a possibility note and then let's look at a guiding note possibility here is the king of pentacles king of coins in a way matches with this energy with completion of knowledge, we are both able to work on those departments of attraction. They are confident that you are attracted to them. They are confident that they have the right steps here in place and they can trust this process. They are confident that what shared goals they have are aligned and they're able to open up to the commitment. So the guiding note has been a coin related as well. This is all about you taking some time to carefully, carefully be assured that this is the choice you're making and at the same time assure this romantic okay, and classical type of persona that yes, there are the elements we are aligned. As much as we may not appear to be aligned, but we have something to work with. And this is all Scorpio, obviously, if it resonates with you. But positive energies, guys, and I like your position. I like that you are seeking this and inspired to go after it. And with that being said, Scorpio, I hope you guys liked the reading. Would love it if you would comment and subscribe. You guys are so amazing. And of course, I want you to know we do love you madly. And bye for now, guys.